Hi, my name is Jasmine Hubbard, and today I'm going to be presenting the 12 new species found in the depths of the Atlantic Ocean. So this discovery was made by a team of over 70 scientists who um, were parts of different backgrounds, and they were part of the Atlas Project. So those involved um, were researchers from 13 countries who took part in this project. Um, its mission was to study the North Atlantic, and originally they were just supposed to map it out, but they ended up discovering and focusing on um, these new species that they had found. It was a five-year um, expedition, um, and underwater robots were used at the service at the surface and on the robots it included cameras and lights so this is one of the species that they found it's an epio epizonanthus martinse which lives on the back on black corals at the depths of almost 400 meters and there you can see a picture of it and it has all these different like tentacles and it's very similar to um i guess uh what you would say um as a coral um so the discovery found in the atlantic so first off they found uh 35 different species living in areas where they were not previously known to reside they found specifically 12 new species and unfortunately there is a negative effect going on with these species that might cause many of them to die and not live very long after this expedition. These threats are the climate change threat which affects up to 50% of coral life who are at risk. There is also a carbon dioxide effect which is affecting the acidity in the ocean and causing corals to basically um, decompose and leave a coral skeleton. So 19% of the deep sea ecosystem services were at high risk from ocean acidification and fisheries. Here we have a picture of corals and they are the foundation of the cities of the deep, providing shelter and food for many species. So without them, um, many of the other species that are not coral would also die off because they rely so heavily on coral for food and shelter. So, of the species found, there was a new kind of coral that was found which you can see in this picture over on the right of my screen. Um, they also found the Ephiozenes martense, which was the picture I showed you in the previous slide with all the white tentacles that lives on the black corals. Um, they found a moss animal, or bryno bryozoan, and it was named a Microporelia, Fun bio. No, it was originally found off the coast of Spain in a mud volcano. They also found a Antropio Antropria get a mar, marita, which feeds on particles of food suspended in the water. So, the outcome of this exp exploration. This project actually was one of a big discovery and we are still discovering so much more about the deep sea and the ocean I mean we know more about the moon than we do about the ocean so this project actually even though it concluded it launched a new study that involved South American researchers to look at the South Atlantic and their exploration would last until 2023 which is a few years down the line. So hopefully um, these explorations of the ocean can lead to more and more 
discovery, exploration, and interest in oceanography. So, for thanks for this um, episode, um, or information, whatever you want to call it, um, my information came from ABC News, um, from the written by Brand, Allison Branley, uh, for the research, robots uncover 12 new species in the deep ocean. I also collected information from BBC News, um, from Victoria Gill, uh, who wrote the paper, Atlantic Discovery, 12 New Species Hiding in the Deep. Um, I also, the original uh, research that I, that led me to all of this was done from NOAA, um, and it was found um, on their discovery page. And then I also want to give credit to Bob Yurka, who wrote the paper, Atlas Project Finds 12 New Species of Sea Creatures on psych.org. Um, thanks for listening and tuning in. Have a nice day.